Well, welcome back, everybody. I'm certain we're going to play some more Battle Brothers. Doing the No Shields Legends mod playthrough, of course. We left off. There's two jobs for us here. Still a job to go burn down something to this northeast and a job to go return a fetish from this place for a fair amount of money. Which I think is, I think that's what we're going to just go do. Let's go take this job. And then I would like to very much discover those bandits up there. I thought we already did it. I already forgot the name of the place. Something tense or something? I don't, I don't know. This should be worth decent money to come up here. How much more repairing do we have? Variants. God, we just endless amounts of them. Alright, so we don't know what's here, but it's gonna be legionaries, I would think. It's like always legionaries. One Holenhund, one Necrosavon. Look at that other place. And many ancient legionaries. Okay. Well, there's only eight total, or nine total, so that's not terrible, I suppose. What is terrible. The fact that we have still a fair amount of piercing weapons. Uh, not as much as we used to. Oh, so there is that. Okay, that's a little unfortunate. It's going to have you, I think, switch out to access. Kind of out of range. Let's just go through and skip people. I don't want to end in ways turn just in case the hound winds up very close to a skin or whatever might be the case. These guys not having shields, I think we should be able to work through them pretty quickly. He says before he gets completely skewered to death. Okay, and he's gone. Fantastic. I imagine he'll wait. And that's not enough to get back. Whoopsies. Chop up the armor a bit, though. Microsoft's gonna come in here and absolutely wreck. close the range. That's kind of what I want. I want to be able to gauge next turn. You can still do it. Okay. Get you up. There's Doggo. Safat comes in. It's nasty right off the bat. Despite getting skewered right there pretty hard, he's still my main con concern. Down. Okay, let's not let you do that anymore. Get 
chop chop Get chop cool Need some shots on him There we go, don't stab him the only place he has armor please Feels good. Feels good. No health left. Come on. Yes. It's gonna say if we net him, can we hold him it still? Oh, we can get hooked there. Very nice. Suck it, dog. It has been sucked. Let's go ahead and that. Who's left? How could I want you out there? Okay. Despite this going pretty well, I still think it's a wise idea not to fight the other one. Let's let him take a stab at him, then move up. There we go, just guess it doesn't kill him. And uh, we got some ashes and some bones and things and stuff. Very nice. I still want to know what that place is. It's back to town, we're pretty good on food. The barbarians don't want to screw with us, it's wise. This decision on their part. I want my three grand. They're high spirits, even. See what a little fetish can do for you? What's this now? Primitive and frostbody, calling himself a king. That's no small feat. But you're not paying me much, though. North from you. Well, that gives us a good reason to go out back out there, doesn't it? Did we get any levels from that point? We sure didn't. Oh yeah, that was really close and easy. It's still... Oh, that's the place I was looking for. Attack them and rid the north of the so-called king. We'll join them in march against the untold. Nah, we'll fight. There's a whole event there. They're trying to kill some undead or something. I don't care. I don't want to fight the undead. Let's just be honest. I don't want to... and plus, I want to get paid. I don't think I get paid unless I kill them. Might not be completely accurate, but. So I think we can rough this guy up pretty quickly. It's just a surround bonus we don't want on us. Good target for us. 
you. So. It's quick hits. Uh, this won't do as much damage, but I think we'll do more armor, armor damage if we hit. So, you know. Triple times, but I rotated you out. Yeah, maybe. It's done. Rotate out with you if we really need to. Hopefully, it doesn't come down to that. Should have rotated him out. Should take that second step. So close to killing him too. Take out the face, you idiot. Level five. Ugh. Oh, there's other leverage jacks out there, though. Doesn't get decent defense if I'm correct, man. Like, unlike our other guy forward here. Trouble will get the freedom of movement. Stay alive. That's what I think to help stay alive as well. He's just a killing machine. Overwhelm actually might not be terrible too. So I got one more. I'm curious about Big Game Hunter, but I don't know. Ah, uh, what a bummer. Well, we better burn this place down just for... You know, just for a good sport. I don't think we're going to get anything for this, considering what's here, but... We made a fair amount of money. Out of the way so we can grow some stuff. Actually, 
actually a decent chance to hit those. I think one of our backline people is able to move to the front now. Felix gets another level. Fantastic. You're level 5 as well. Brella is level 9, however. They're traumatizing all that. She's just, I don't think she's really level. However, we're going to need to give you something better. You're going to be another heavy armor kind of bro. But you got the defense to do that. That's too bad. Six for 35, that's awful. Same. Yeah, it's just the ancient stuff's terrible. Ugh, we really need to go armor. I'm hunting. Uh, fearless of yeah, Ahab. If I could keep getting these, and I just keep loving it, but we really need to stack. Oh, your health finally got good. Do I want that plus four initiative or do I want that plus four fatigue? Because your fatigue is really not great either. I kind of think we have to. Like, you're all about the initiative, but. And what's your total right now? 13. 6. It's up to 19. We need to be at 15, right? Hmm. I mean, honestly. It's not doing much in your back pocket, but it's also not hurting you. Favorite enemies, favorite enemies. Just making sure there wasn't anything else. Night Raider, plus one vision. Attacking night adjacent enemies will lose 10 resolve. Gain plus 10% melee range skill. Oof. That's pretty good. That's also pretty good. This and Nimble would just go really great together. I don't think Nimble would be terrible for you right now. Though I wanted to tweak your armor some more. As you lose your home, did I burn it down? Tools. Alright, there's our pay. Because we didn't take that quest, they still have. Ugh, that's annoying. Which pain for my wolf skin right now? So we got a lot of junk. Oh, we've been a lot. Yeah, we have... Okay, we have a fair amount of money. I think we can do something with it. Not here, though. I 
as fortunate as that is. Anything spectacular? Probably not. Bullhammer is not really a terrible idea. There's someone in the back. Who? I'm not quite sure yet. They're giving me pretty good prices on things. It's not terrible. Anybody could utilize it right now, though? No, you have to have spears. You don't have to have axes, but that's the only thing that makes sense. You have to have axes. Specialize in sword. It's probably gonna give you this. I could give you that. And then give you like a nice bull hammer. Huge decrease in your damage, but it's the hammer. Why not? We're gonna see more and more armor as time comes. Hopefully real soon. we can give you this perk, and then we can give you that perk. Increasing the amount of damage we do would be really nice. Plus, it, we got a lot of money. We just have a lot of money. Anybody here I want to come with? Mr. Bear. You are indeed strong. And irrational. But your stars kind of suck. Farmers, butchers, armors. That's an expensive armor. What is this now? Nyctophobia. That's terrible. Well, let's leave town then. Do you have any good rumors for me? No. I'm gonna head east to where they sell good armors. We need upgrade armors. What's this now? What's this now? Force north, our primeval place. The span of the life is measured in months in the climate. It's a perpetual state of autumn, winter. When the wildlife is deadly, it's the weather. Walking through the forest is humbling. The trees here have outlived, but the gods themselves, or so some would say. Your thoughts begin to wander further. This brittle path begins to feel endless. The trees curl inwards. Pressure builds in your head as you fall to the ground. Brush parts for a woman clad in furs holding a staff, focusing intently on you as you try to regain your balance. The noise stops and your mind clears. The woman speaks. Why are you here, outsider? Her brow furrows. She hums, but her lips part again. I know what you are, and I know what you have done, not just in this life, but other ones. Her gaze lifts as she focuses on you and you look down the path, deep in palpitation. Wait, and your mind begins to lift as the tide ebbs before it comes crashing back. However, as she fixes her gaze with yours, the wave doesn't come crashing back. It's still there, the back of her head, strained like a warhound on a chain. Something is changing outside her, something is coming, but we cannot stand alone and face. If you're not careful your work, your motives, or hardships, Care about stopping the cataclysm of what is to come. Lips curse. Shall we begin? Nothing stops. The pain lifts as fast as it comes. Despite what people from the south say, the grip of the old gods remains firm. Welcome. So we picked up a new person. Fantastic. Vala. So this is a special event, obviously, that happens. And you can pick up somebody. And if I remember correctly, they can actually... Uh, yeah, create runes for things. I don't know if rune shields will really be helpful for us. But they can create runes so we can enchant our items, which are pretty good. Each individual has a spirit warden, follows their soul from birth, Fala, being spiritually attuned, has a remarkable connection. Allows it to manifest, automatically summons the warden to start a fight. It can be beaten but never dies. Lives, Pathfinder, Recover, Student seems really good. Backstabber, Fortified Mind. Malevolent Spirits, Trance. The spirit world is home to many malevolent beings, and the Vala knows how to contact them. Once your access to the realm has been established, she calls upon these ill willed spirits in hopes of receiving their help. If she's successful, the spirits will 
harass, torment, and weaken their foes. They also spread out affected other entities. Ammunition is being warned. Uh, like it's occasional glimpses in the immediate future in danger may hold letting repairs of the ballot. Avoid incoming damage. Her understanding of these visions grow. She becomes more experienced. Resilient helmets. Fantastic. Chance build up 25% less fatigue. And great potence. Trance mastery. If your trance is built up less fatigue, 50% chance not drop or trance when receiving damage. Successful trances will not occur. Alert. Inscription mastery. Allowing her to create a rune faster. Yeah, so that's going to be her main thing, I think, for us. Is making runes for armors and whatnot. Very disagreeable and confidence chant that makes it almost impossible for the Valet enemies to focus and concentrate. Enemies adjacent to the Valet are in, unable to enforce zone of control. Making, okay, that's not that great, I feel. Uh, the carries the skill doubles the bonus of theirs, but the total bonus I think it's above 10%. And mushrooms, poisons, and its powders. But it's a fate. Work to, work to work. And then each attack has a chance to apply a stacking debuff. Each stack lowers maximum hit points and increases the amount of damage taken. Interesting. Spiritual bond. Percentage of the Vala's incoming health damage is dealt to the ward instead, up to 50%. Is also gains a scaling damage. Okay. Fury allies within three tiles, while including yourself, receive bonus damage output and a chance to retaliate. Attackers. Oh. Oh. Weapons. Field triage. Spend medicine to heal a unit on the battlefield. One medicine for every two health, up to 20 health. Ocean Brewer. Perfect focus. Expertise and pokers. The skill unlocks the chance to create Lionheart, Iron Will, Recovery Potions, Cat Potions, Gathering. Let's gather the ingredients to push brewer. The total of our brewers push rank is above 20 in the Occupy's background. It's alcohol crafting and crafting time. Okay. Interesting. So, what do we want to do with her? That's kind of a great question. Got some very strange stars. Let's definitely take that because I don't want her getting shot and killed instantly. I kind of feel like the plus two is maybe not a bad idea. If this wasn't a no shields run. I would honestly just give her a shield and say so sit back there and cast magic. <laughs> I thought these also worked off of. like a resolve or something. But I guess I'm not correct in that. We'll take the resolve anyways. I mean that's kind of nice. But I imagine it has to hit. Feeding feeding Poison power feeding? Like I can drain their life? Very interesting. Ambitious, extra experience. Magmatic. Okay, excellent. Extra experience gain. Oh, she's gonna level up quickly then. That's pretty nice. Get her the student too, I think. Wow, what a what an event just to kind of go through randomly. slip on by here without any good fights. I really just want to make it to the east here so we can start buying some armors. Which I'll do off camera. Because I don't think anyone wants to... That's probably going to be like literally 20 minutes. I'm just waiting through that. These are expensive. That's fine. Anybody here? I kind of doubt it. I 
I want to, I want to do better than you. Okay. That's, that's hard to argue with. I mean, for a hundred dollars, come on. He has to be in the back though, right? No, you're fighting. Oh, okay. This went up. He's increased for some reason. Uh, great news for guys in the back who want to stab people to death. Um, I any armor for you right now because I kind of sold it. But that's okay. I mean, 54 is not a terrible start either. He doesn't need to have a lot of fatigue. He doesn't need to have a lot of really anything. He just sit in the back, poke people to death, and... Get a nice bird or something. Just let him go to town. Sword Lance, maybe. Sword Lance could be good. Holy moly, yeah. He's got dodge. He's got high initiative. Plus, he's got two stars in it, so we can go dodge. We can go balance. We can go freedom of movement, too, to keep him from just getting destroyed. But he's also got a star range defense. So I mean, like, that's pretty solid. His base health is high. Just get him Colossus. We wouldn't have to put points in that, really, either. Got some good stuff here. I think that guy's going to be pretty good for 100 bucks. You know, assuming that he doesn't get instant killed without any armor on. I stop at Haglin, and then I think I'm just going to hit these two towns for armor. They didn't have armor. They just had cheap armor, so. Let's go up here. Just sell footprints. Okay, they're going away. Yeah, I want to be buying red or bros, but when you got three stars like that, fighting and defense. Oop, camera. Alright, well, this is where I'll end it. I'll go into town there and see what see what's going on. Uh, and then afterwards, when we start the next episode, I'll go over everything that I bought and kind of look at everyone's new equipment so we can kind of talk about it. That way there's no real confusion, but you don't have to watch me go through and peel pieces of things off each other and stuff like that. I think it will be better that way. Let me know your thoughts. If you really wanted to watch me do that and you're kind of bummed that for some reason that you don't get to see that, please let me know. I'd love to hear it. But I want to thank everyone for coming by and taking time out of their day to watch these videos with me. It really does mean the world to me. So thank you for those that have. I hope you guys are having a great day. Please take care. Stay safe. And I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.